Okay guys. I already decided on where to work next, and I will work at 5 guys. Are you ready to come work with me? Yes we are general guy. We're ready. Alright. Here we, wait. We wanna work with you guys too. Wait. Don't I remember you guys? You must be the evil versions of sports from 09, Dan Hamming, Nathan Barr, Derry and Pip. Right? Yes. And we would like to work with you in your next job, and watch you serve the customers in the next episode. Is it okay if we do that? Yes. You guy can. Now let's go. Okay guys. Since you guys are here to watch me, time to give all of you healing factors. Wow. Thank you so much General Guy for giving us the healing factors. We feel super powerful now. You're welcome. Now you may take your seats. Okay General Guy and the rest of you. I am now in enraged mode and the background is now dark orange. Five more turn off before evil mode starts and the background will be red. If that ever happens in this job when five more turn offs is lost, I will be in evil mode. Note, I won't be back in normal mode until your final job is over. But I'll keep stay using angry modes and evil modes while your every jobs is starting, and to still think about where to work next. Alright Fate Barney. Anyways, the first customer is coming. That's right. Get fucking lost you stupid motherfuckers. Because really, my little pony characters are never fucking welcome here at fucking all. Bitches. Welcome to... Get out of here. No fucking baby show characters allowed. Go right now. Welcome to Five Guys. How may we help you? I would like to have a bacon cheeseburger, large fries, and a large Coke. We're sorry, but the bacon cheeseburgers is sold out. No, it's not. I just saw some bacon cheeseburger in the kitchen with my own eyes. You're just fucking seeing shit. Get the fucking hell out of this place now. You're just like some other employees I met. I'm just going to Outback Steakhouse instead. I hope I never see you again. I'm out of here because you people are wanted. Okay, for saying that general guy is wanted, it also counts as turning it off. Yeah, I agree. You better stay that fucking hell out of this restaurant right fucking now before we all kill you to death. Bitch. I'm out of here because some of you people abuses animals. That's right you fucking bitch. They were not going to give you shit anyways because you're a baby show character. And baby show characters are not fucking welcome at any restaurants at all, you stupid ass Dora ripoff character. I agree with Evil Caillou. And that will also count as turning it off. Since we don't allow logos slash baby show characters slash flags here in any places. Welcome. Hey you. You look like another baby from Chester Chicken with Liu Carrier. Sorry what? I never met you before. Oh sorry. You just look like another baby that I met in my 69th job. Really? Who is it? And what did look like? Well, he wear platinum outfit, just like Lucaria, because this baby and Lucaria are now the champion from the Shy Canines character elimination ultimate. Oh, that's my baby husband Jirachi boy. I met him back on 2019 on Go Animate for Schools. Anyway, I'm here order for me and my baby husband. What? You are baby wife? Actually, forget what I said. I wanted to say was, I'm actually give you a surprise. Really? Are you serious? Yes I'm serious. Why wouldn't I be? Oh, wow, thank you so much. You're welcome. Now let's get to the important part. Do you want to see your present? Of course I do. Why I wouldn't I? Are you sure about this young lady? Yes I am Mr. Shy Guy. Just show me. Alright then. I will show you your surprise in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, now. Mm. 
Why Mr. Shy Guy? Why are you mean to me? That's actually scare me. And since Jirachi is food from Japan, I'm going to eat you for dinner. No 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 It's been a while since I've done good pranks. This is the best day ever. To be honest, I do have to agree. But anyways, let's move on right now. Well, get up, bitch. Not had many characters allowed. Hey! How dare you tell me I'm not allowed in this restaurant? That's it. I'm going to another Five Guys instead. I hope that I don't see you again. Go get run over by 1,997 GMC Yukon SLE. Welcome to Five Guys. How may we help you? I'm sorry, but I'm not getting anything here because Evil Caillou, some of those people watching you, and four of those employees working with you are animal abusers. Oh my god, when will people ever stop calling us animal abusers? Okay? You're fucking banned from every Five Guys restaurant for saying that shit. Get fucking lost and never fucking come back ever again for the rest of your boring ass life. I agree with Evil Caillou. This will also count as turning it off as well too. Welcome to... Oh hi there classic Kailu and the John Riley Max version of Rosie. Nice to see you too here. Nice to see you too general guy. Anyways, we're not here to buy shit at all. Since we're a big fans of you, we would like to watch you serve the customers right now. But keep in mind I'm watching Stinky Pete still. Also, before you get out your want to give us healing factors, we already have those healing factors. So no need to. Anyways, we're going to take our seats now. I'm out of here because that employee up front was rude to my boyfriend at McAllen bus station. Well, it looks like you're banned from every restaurant for life for saying that shit. Get lost. Welcome to Five Guys. How may we help you? How oh, motherfucking no. I'm not getting anything from those five employees working with you, not after what they did to my friend's parents at Krispy Kreme. I'm getting out of here right now. Also, to let you know now, my friend Chelsea is coming for you. <laughs> oh my god. How adorable is that? A small piece of shit is coming for me and my gang just because I killed her parents. We will actually have to see about that because I would like to see her try that bat. Ha 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 Keep laughing now, but you will see when she beats the crap out of you. Now shut the fuck up. You know, I may not scare of a little girl beating the crap out of me, but in my opinion, it's actually cute. I have assaulted over so many people my jobs, so I can for sure beat her also. But anyways, let's move on. Welcome to... Get your stupid motherfucking pony ass out of here right now. There are no My Little Pony characters allowed. Get out of here right fucking now, you stupid piece of goddamn fucking shitty shit shit. Fine. I'm leaving. I never wanted anything from you anyways because not only that you're the guy who killed Twilight Sparkle's parents and most of her friends, but I also heard from Applejack that you said so many heartless things about our show at Chester's Chicken. Congratulations! For mention of all general value the Twilight Sparkle shitty family and friends, you're banned from every Five Guys wrestling forever. I agree with the bet. You motherfucking lost and never come back to a fucking sleeves again for the rest of your fucking ass life. Bitch.
Oh, and before you guys even ask on why Orbit and Cooper are watching me serve the customers, well, since they are one of Raven's gang members, they're now part of my gang, for why they're watching me right now. And yes, they're still watching Stinky Pete, because any troublemaker can watch any rude slash wanted employee. Anyways, let's move on right now. Welcome to Five Guys. How may we help you? I would like to have a double bacon cheeseburger with ketchup on it, please. We're sorry, but the double bacon cheeseburgers are only available during the month of January. That's not true. It's still on the menu. The menu is lying, you idiot. Get the fuck out of this Five Guys restaurant and never fucking return. That's it, I'm going to Burger King instead. I hope that I don't see you again. Welcome to... Get out of here right now. We don't fucking serve any shit to baby show characters. Welcome to Five Guys. How may we help you? I would like to have a cheeseburger with mayo, please. Here you go. You can have this burger for free. Wow. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Enjoy your free food. Welcome to Get the Fuck Out. I heard that you two are no longer troublemakers, and you're also improving your behaviors as well. Get your shitty scary asses out of this place before we assault you two to fucking death. Fine. W, you are leaving. We never wanted anything from you anyways because of the stuff you did on the news. Goodbye, bitch. Oh my god, can you please shut the fuck up about what we did on the news? That is none of your fucking shitty ass business. I agree with K-Guy Chutsuki. And for mentioning what we did on GNN, and for calling General Guy a bitch, when that's actually you two, you two are banned from every five guys around the world forever. Welcome. No. You're the guy who beat them in Charmy up in one of our jobs. Not only that, but Stinky Pete told us about what you did to him and Edwin of Canada McDonald's. We're not going anywhere this time. For that, everyone, get him.
that's what you fucking get for beating me and charm in for killing Dr. Eggman. I agree with Dark Bowser. And we're not calling security this time because we're too lazy to do it. Anyways, your next customer is coming. Welcome to... No. You're that guy who got revived by two assholes from Eric Bonifacio slash slash Pokemon Fan 2003's universe. You're not going anywhere this time. And for that, we're going to let the reanimated version of the real Nathan Barter kill you. Reanimated Nathan, get him. Working on it, General Guy.
This is your fucking punishment for being brought back to life by some assholes from Merrick Bonifacio slash slash Pokemon Fan 2003's universe. And no, you're not going to get revived this time. You're going to be reanimated, and no one is going to revive you this time. And yes, I'm still technically dead after the beaten I gotten at Freddy's Steak Burgers. And the video Eric Bonifacio slash slash Pokemon Fan 2003 made will not count because the people that the rude slash wanted employees killed are not supposed to be back to life at all. Now to take the body with me. Welcome to. Okay, since when do stadiums go to restaurants to eat? Okay, you get your ass out of here now. At least your life without saying anything, after I said something stupid. I agree with you caddies Bowser. Plus that was weird. What kind of customers are we even going to see next? Just who? I can imagine anyone worst right now. Anyways, a South Park character is coming. At least it's not one of them who caused Gerald trouble. Welcome to Five Guys. How may we help you? I would like to have a cheeseburger with ketchup and mustard, large fries, and a large Coke. Okay, but before we give you your order, would you like a free drink? Sure. Wait, what are you doing with those? It's your free drink and a snack that goes with it. And that toxic waste is not toxic waste. It's just a regular drink. Now, take this. Wow. Oh my god. Oh my god. You just threw pop rocks, coke and toxic waste at my face. Oh my god my eyes are burning up. No. No. I think something's about to happen. <laughs> God. They hit some cells of my brain. Oh my god. I need to get outside real quick. Oh my god. That has got to be the most hilarious thing we have ever done. This is even more funnier than what Bomboo and Dark Boo did to Trixie's dad. I agree. He totally had that coming. This is literally the most hilarious thing you have ever done. Now he's out there crying like a little baby and nobody is gonna save him. I agree with Max. I seriously can't believe he fell for it. He deserved that. You should make a list of hilarious pranks you pulled in your jobs one day. No. You're all in so much trouble right now. I literally saw what you just did to the kid. Some of his cells exploded and after that, he passed out. What is wrong with all of you? Now I believe he's in critical condition because of that prank you pulled. And Dark Bowser and Dark Ice Princess, I cannot believe you assaulted and killed Bowser Jr., Baby Bowser, Baby Ice Princess, and your mother of Krispy Kreme, Mama's Korean restaurant, and Freddy Stabriggers. Even worse, you assaulted so many people and killed some of them. That's it. After I tell your boss, Dark Bowser and Dark Ice Princess, you- No. Not this time. Dad, you have been grounding me in Dark Ice Princess nonstop. Not only that, but you kicked me out of the house all because I destroyed houses, and you sent me to the dungeon all because I wished Lincoln Rowd an unhappy birthday. Those triggered me so much. I agree with Dark Bowser. And my nice clone, for all the crap you've done to US, and for trying to hunt down all the people who killed your wife and your other kids, all of US, except for Itachi, Apicho, Nagato, and classic Lori Loud, are going to give you the biggest beating ever until you perish. I agree. And Dad, you're going to pay for leaving me, Mom, Baby Bowser and Baby Ice Princess to die. And nothing will stop US at all since they're one of the main targets for our revenge. We don't dare if you were in jail or busy with other stuff. I agree with Bowser Jr. Me too. Now everyone, except for Itachi, Obito, Nagato and classic Lori Loud, let's give this jerk the biggest beating of a lifetime. Wait. We wanna help kick the crap out of him because we want revenge on him for trying to hunt us down all because we killed his loved ones. And don't worry. Our gang members, all of his troublemaking clones, and all of the troublemakers from Jacob Harrington's universe are here to help out as well. Okay then. But before we teach him a lesson, General Guy, use your moon and pumpkin ones on him right now. Okay.
there. Now all of your healing factors and powers are gone and you're not getting them back. Now dad, it's time for you to be taught a huge lesson on never to ground or punish me in Dark Ice Princess or cause trouble to our friends without thinking about the future consequences. No. We Don't want you to ever help dare. too because we no. want revenge on him no. for beating us no. up at Uno Chicago Bar and Grill. <laughs> Finishing blow. That's what you get for grounding me in Dark Ice Princess nonstop.
This is why you don't ever mess with the almighty dark Bowser and the almighty dark ice princess. And this is what you also get for beating me, Gerald, Charmy, Cybrick Mir, Cybrick Bendlow and Eagle Lashlin up at her home Mongolian grill. I agree with Devious Diesel. Me too. And this is what you also get for beating me, Portia and Sailor John up at a no Chicago bar and grill. This is also why you don't ever mess with the almighty Portia and Gwyn. And this is also why you don't ever mess with the almighty Sailor John. I agree. And this is also what you get for beating me and my gang members up at RMW. This is also why you don't ever mess with the almighty Fire Blaster. I agree with everything they're saying. And this is what you get for breaking your promise to me, Mom, Baby Bowser and Baby Ice Princess and leaving us to die. I agree with them. And this serves you right for trying to hunt us all down. I agree with everything they're saying. This is why you don't ever mess with the almighty rude slash wanted employees or any of their gang members, even though I wasn't a part of any of those incidents. Oh, my, absolute, mother, of, God. Oh, 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 General Guy, Dark Bowser, Dark Ice Princess, Caddy's Bowser, Evil Dan Hamming, Evil Dougie O'Connell, Evil Pip Pirip, Evil Nathan Barr, Evil Sports Fan 09, Evil Damien Thorne, and Evil Bessie Higginbottom. I cannot believe you were rude to the customers. Even worse, you threw pop rocks, coke, and toxic waste at a kid's face. Now he's probably gonna die because of that. Even more worse, I cannot believe you, and all of your gang members, severely assaulted two customers extremely badly. That's so IT. You're all fired and banned from every single five guys forever. And when I... No. No. You have caused me so much trouble in the motherfucking past. You keep on defeating me and my minions in your games, and keep on grounding me non-stop in Kelly Loves Michael Jackson and Bruno Mars's videos. You know what? I've had it with you, Mara. For all the crap you done to me in the past, and for trying to report us to the news, we're all going to give you the biggest beating ever until you die. Not to mention the married of villains watching us want to get revenge on you for all the crap you done to them as well. We had enough of you. Prepare yourself for the biggest beating ever for messing with every villain. And here it comes right now.
Dark Mario. In all of Mario's troublemaking clones are here to help out because he also causes trouble to US as well. And yes, Master Kikita Mount and the rest of his gang members are here to help out as well.
everyone. Let's get all together for the ultimate finishing blow to finish him off once and for all.